first video, I'm showing my art supplies that I'm using in this video. Audio out. Okay, so these are my Koi watercolors. I got them at Michael's. They're nice. I like them. Um, I typically use Artist Loft watercolors, which are very pigmented, but they're very inexpensive and cheap, which kind of makes them not good. They're student grade, obviously. They're like $6 at Michael's, but I like them. I've made a lot of pieces with them before. Um, I used them in college when I went for one semester, um, so I liked them. They worked for me, but um, this is my gouache set. It is moving fast. Okay. Uh, it's a Magello palette with whole bean and oil magnetical gouache. Um, and I just like do it by this color spectrum because it works for me. I even put a thing right there that says what it's in it. Right, these are the brushes that I use. I didn't use all of them, but these are typically what I use when I do uh, use watercolor. And I like them. And I like them because they're really good they hold a lot of water they're synthetic brushes i also like um the brush pens the ones that you fill with water and use with watercolor um these are the hermit crabs that i'm painting obviously from the title of this video um i chose hermit crabs because i was watching a lot of lee ellickson videos she's an artist here on youtube that um she paints a lot of little animals and people and landscape she paints everything she's really good i like her color scheme she typically uses like blues and pinks and yellows um and now the painting has started so i'm so bad at voiceovers and since i'm bad at voiceovers i'm just gonna stop talking and let you watch the video um thanks for watching it this is the first video that i'm actually proud of and i'm happy to be uploading it you don't have to like it, you don't have to do any of all that stuff that people typically say at the end of voiceovers. Um, just thank you for watching it. I really appreciate it. And that's it. Thank you.